had a little company, used to be in America, called NASA, standing for National Air Space Exploration. <laughs> Take my word for it, niggas. It stood for going up there. Look at white people, that is not what it stood for at all. <laughs> that would be N-E-A-S-A. -S -A. We don't know what it's called. <laughs> Fact of the matter is, NASA used to report to us. Let us know what the fuck they was doing. And for 40 years, they spent $500 million a year sending space shuttles up, bringing them back down. And they used to let us see them when they took off. And then when they landed, we'd be right there and we'd say, show us what you got. <laughs> then they started doing sneaky shit. Taking off the space shuttles at three o'clock in the goddamn morning and shit. <laughs> Landing them in the middle of the night and if ain't nobody looking, they just walk off. Just And now on CNN, they say they just discovered 16 new super Earths. 16 new super Earths. Now let me speak for all niggas when I say what the fuck. Here's a goddamn super Earth. We thought this motherfucker was super the whole goddamn time. Look at niggas, I don't believe none of this shit. Huh? It's true, niggas. They had it on CNN the same goddamn day I was on CNN. How the fuck could I have missed that? They put the shit right up under me, blew a nigga's whole high. Just 16 new supers. They planning on leaving us, people. Please remember where you heard it first, right at the cusp of 2012. They are planning on leaving our motherfucking ass right there. They got space shittles lined up with GPS navigation on star. Because remember when I told you the 99% them was niggas? And we're the original niggas. Rich people is tired of going on vacation, seeing niggas. Rich people make a hundred million dollars, can't escape niggas. Make a hundred million dollars, go to Africa for a safari, and all they want to see is some animals. Niggas everywhere. There was a nigga that led us to the giraffe. Ain't that a bitch?